Hello again, another video from me. Okay, so this time what we've got is a quadrilateral drawn in so that the four vertices just touch the edge of a circle. And therefore, this, the quadrilateral has a special name. It's called a cyclic quadrilateral. So a quadrilateral where the four vertices touch the circumference of the circle is called a cyclic quadrilateral. Now, if you click here and you look at the angles, and we can move these around a little bit if you want, what do you notice? Maybe pause the video for a moment to have a look. What you should have noticed is that the opposite angles add up to 180 degrees. Okay, you can see these two add up to 180 and these two add up to 180. Now why is that so? Let's have a look at the centre. So that's the centre of the circle. Let's have a look at points, um, angles B and D, the red ones. Okay, if we look here and we draw in the centre ones here, just move it around a little bit. So move it around a little bit. Now what you will see is that this one here is twice this one here. Sorry. Yes. This one here is half of this one here. Okay. And likewise, this one here is half of this one here. All right. And this is because the angle at the center is twice the angle at the circumference. Okay, and then if we just check the other two here, a similar sort of thing happens. Yeah, you can see that this one is double this one here, and that this one is double this one here. Now, the angles in the centre add up to 360. If these are each half of the ones in the centre, then these two will add up to 180. So what we're saying here is that the opposite angles of a cyclic quadrilateral, the opposite angles add up to 180 degrees and this applet shows you why. I will put the uh, link for the applet in the notes for underneath the YouTube video. Thank you very much for watching and I hope this helps your understanding.